Hello, dear traders. Today is the 2nd of April, Tuesday. I'm presenting you with a fresh market analysis prepared for the InstaForex company. This day is rich in macroeconomic events. Thus, traders may focus on U.S. services, PMI and oil reserves figures. What is more, Jerome Powell will provide a speech later today. This may affect the currency pairs that contain the greenback. Let us switch to the trading charts. Thus, gold is gradually gaining in value. At present, it's trading at 22.20 USD per troy ounce. Curiously, I remember a period when gold cost less than 1,000 USD. During the last two months, the British metal has gained 2,700 pips. A rise in gold could be considered a fair indicator, or it may point to a decline in the greenback. Those who bought the asset at the mirror level of 2144 USD now feel quite confident and make a considerable profit. However, I suppose that the instrument may start trading sideways one day. In this case, it may show a breakout of the mentioned level, even a false one. The euro dollar pair is losing value. The trend which began in the middle of March is likely to continue. The faster an asset falls, the faster it will rise. An increasing number of black candlesticks on the chart reflects a rising number of retail buyers in the market. If there are no obvious trading signals, it's better not to trade against the trend. The situation with the Australian dollar is the same. This week it has already broken its last week's low. At present there are no reversal signs. However, the known farm data, which is slated for release this week, may change the overall situation. The pound dollar pair is also continues falling. Below the level of 1.25, there is a buyer's area. The asset may drop by another 600 pips. If the price increases amid US non farm payrolls, traders may earn up to 2,000 pips. Meanwhile, the dollar yen pair is trying to exceed the previous highs. Against this backdrop, it will be wise to close short orders. Notably, the pair is hovering at all-time highs. There is a chance that the pair may slide. However, you should keep in mind that the Bank of Japan may cause a considerable change in the market situation. Silver is still moving towards the level of 30 USD. For now, I'm going to stop there. Stay tuned for our next video review.